I need flight crews to transport this valuable merchandise across the galaxy. Morning, everybody. It's Tuesday, January 10th. Um, this is going to be the start of my first week in Florida vlog. So I'll be taking you guys along with me um, with everything I'm going to do this week, which actually is a lot um, because I think I got almost something every day, I would say. Um, but yeah, so this morning I had to go uh, to background check and that was over in East. So I literally just went there this morning. Um, luckily I had a morning slot, so it went by super quick. I was in and out of there in 15 minutes. Um, I just checked in, told them I didn't commit a crime, and then they fingerprinted all 10 of my fingers, and then that was it. So um, right now I'm just sitting in the Target parking lot. Uh, it's the baby Target right across from Flamingo. Austin had to run in there real quick. Um, and then we're gonna just kind of figure out what to do for the rest of the day until I have to take Austin to the airport around uh, one o'clock for him to fly back home. Um, and then I think I'm just gonna get settled in for the rest of the day. Maybe I'll go get my nails done. I, I don't know, sky's the limit at this point. Um, but yeah, so I will, kind of show you guys what we're gonna do for the rest of the day um but yeah i'll be back with that wait i forgot to tell y'all um i did get starbucks and i'm about to put y'all on the best drink it is a mango dragon fruit refresher i get it without water or you could get it with water um it kind of just depends on how the um barista takes the order um but you add peach juice and you add vanilla and I don't like the berries, um, so I get it without berries. I guess you could technically call this the rose gold drink. It's so good. So good. 10 out of 10. Recommend. Alrighty. So, it's a little while later. Um, basically, for the last time, I talked to y'all. Um, me and Austin just hung out for the rest of the day. We ran into a couple different targets to try to get some last minute stuff for my room. Um, and then I just dropped him off at the airport. Um, that one was, um, I'm not gonna lie, it was a little hard. Um, I was doing fine until he hit me with the I'm proud of you line. Yeah, um, bawled my eyes out, but it's, it's fine um, because He'll be back down here. Um, he got a job only about an hour away from Disney, so um, it's not awful. Just still kind of sucks, but it's fine. So I am now on my way back home to Flamingo. Um, still haven't decided yet. I need to get groceries because I have zero food. Actually, the only food that I have is this bag of toys that is on my car floor. Um, so, but yeah, I need to decide if I want to go to Target before I go back to Flamingo or go back there first and then Target. I might go back there first because I still have like two bags to take in from the hotel. Um, and then kind of just freshen up, get all my stuff situated in my apartment, but yeah, um, I do have a welcome event tonight, which I'm really excited about, um, I unfortunately didn't get to sign up for the meet and greet that's happening tonight, but I might see if I can do a drop in, I don't know, but I'm really excited just because it's going to be the first time. Um, I really get to hang out with people, um, I get to hang out with my friend Sydney, um, who, she, she lives over at East Campus, um, and then I think some of my roommates are also going, so, yeah, I'm really excited, um, but yeah, that's my little update for now, and I'll check back in with you later. So, actually, um, I forgot to share this. Disney is actually
actually releasing like every bomb dropping like thing today um happily ever after's return just got announced on april 3rd and also harmonious is gone that day or before that and epcot forever is coming back for a little bit i haven't seen harmonious so i don't have an opinion on it um i'm hoping to see it before it does like go away though um, but I'm super excited about Happily Ever After coming back. It's my favorite um, fireworks show. Um, I just don't get the same reaction whenever I watch Enchantment that I do with um, Happily Ever After. But um, yeah, that's fine. So I'm really excited for that. And then Tron's opening the next day. The next day. So I'm hoping they're doing cast previews. I'm sure they'll do cast previews for Tron. Um, and with me working in Magic Kingdom, I'm hoping I kind of get first pick on it. Um, so I'm really, really excited about that. However, with both of us happening in like a day of each other, um, work's going to be crazy. Um, yeah. It's gonna be crazy. Um, I also just got my schedule today and I am super excited to announce I'm working in Under the Sea with the Little Mermaid or the Aerial Ride. Um, I can't remember the specific name of it, but yeah, I think it's that. I think it's like Under the Sea, the journey of the Little Mermaid something along those lines but yeah i'm super super excited about that um but yeah that's my little update for y'all um i just turned on happily ever after and it reminded me of everything that happened today with all the announcements <laughs> Tuesday. This is Sydney. Hello, everybody. You want to tell them where you're working? I'm working in Animal. I'm waiting for the lights to turn green. <laughs> I'm working in Animal Kingdom in outdoor vending. Mm -hmm. um, we are on our way to After Hours event. Um, kind of forgot to vlog today. It's fine. We're still getting the habit of doing so. So today, honestly, was not too eventful until now. Um, we both had a class, it was like making the most of your magic, something like that, and kind of just talking about networking and like what to expect and like how we can do different classes and such. So that only like was 45 minutes out of our day. Um, after that, we went to Springs. Um, my roommates were here earlier with us, um, but then we parted ways and we're now on our way to Hollywood Studios for our After Hours event. Um, ticketed event we had to pay for it but honestly it's gonna be worth it because we'll get in at like seven o'clock um and then it's open what, three hours after park close yeah. so we'll be there until like 12 30 tonight and we get unlimited free popcorn mickey bars mickey ice cream sandwiches like coca-cola and then we get to pretty much walk onto all the rides um but since we get there at 7, we're hoping that we can get into Oga's Cantina and maybe Fantasmic. <laughs> um, we'll see. Hopefully we'll both. See. Yeah. We'll, fingers crossed on both because there's two showings of Fantasmic tonight. I don't know what time, so, so we'll look them up. But yeah, um, but we'll see you inside then. Okay, little update. Uh, we just got into the parks. Um, we walked on to Smuggler's Run. Literally. That was the best time I think I ever went on that ride. Um, we were the pilots, yeah. and then we had a family of three behind us. It was so funny. It was so good. Yeah, they were great. Um, I'm glad that they, like, interacted with us, too. <laughs> it was, like, 
It was just what you wish, like, whenever you get random, like, people in your party. But we ended up snagging a reservation for Ogre's Cantina. So uh, we're just waiting to get called back to go in there. Um, yeah, and then we're going to show you some of the, like, interior stuff. But we might get placed, like, with other people at a table. So um, if we do, I don't want to, like, put <laughs> a camera in their face. So we'll show you, like, what we get and, like, I'll voice over it, you know. But, yeah, we'll show you that. Alrighty, so we just got out of Oga's. Um, Amazing. We, it was really fun. We both got a drink and a half. We split the second one. No, just we did. Yes, we did. He only charged us once. Oh, really? Just once? Well, yeah. Two? Yeah. Pretty oh, much. He pretty okay. much filled our cups up the whole way. So, like, shout out to Josh. Yeah, honestly, shout out to Josh. I didn't um, think that. Yeah. I didn't think that. Um, that and I think the pork mug, the pog, pork pog, whatever the little yeah. animal is. Um, probably has two. Yeah, it probably was that bigger. That makes sense. Or, but at least I would hope it would have two yeah. because it had, it was 48 bucks. Not, yeah. not what we, we didn't paid. pay that. Not what we paid. <laughs> um, we basically paid 48 bucks for the four drinks we yeah, had. Yeah, exactly. Um, but now we're on the hunt for churros <laughs> and a pretzel. <laughs> to soak up everything that's in our body. Yes. And then we are... <laughs> Sorry. Is it cold? Except for Aliens for Alien Saucer, which we could have just we decided not to because um, I have beef with that um, with that ride. Yeah, um, I have come to a conclusion. That I'm coming out with a sound disinfection, so this should be fun. Um, I gotta find my daddy pot somewhere. But yeah, um, ticket 100% worth it. If you can do after hours, do it. I wouldn't recommend it after a full day at a park. But to do like starting at seven or whenever you're able to get in, 100% do it. Um, but yeah, so we're going back to Flamingo now and we're going straight to bed. Yes. Yeah. See you tomorrow. Hey y'all, so it's Thursday morning um, and me and my roommates are heading to Whispering Cafe, Whispering Canyon Cafe um, to go get breakfast. I'm not entirely sure how much I'm gonna be uh, vlogging today just because I still got sinuses going on and of course I would be the one to get sick right before tart traditions and starting work. So um see you later on in the day depending on how much I decide to vlog today. Have to. I can just use one of y'all's pictures. <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all so um <laughs> it's been a while um nothing really happened that much today so we went to whispering canyon cafe um this morning and then i did some work for my internship um did a meeting with um, my boss and then uh, we went over to the Polynesian we went to Trader Sam's that was really fun um, got some dumplings and then a drink and now we're back um, I'm going to be editing my moving vlog hopefully I can get that up today since I got my Wi-Fi on my computer working um yeah I think we're just gonna be chilling for the rest of the night we might play some like card games but nothing too exciting uh but traditions is tomorrow and i'm so excited 
it um probably will cry um and then yeah but if i don't do anything else tonight i will see you guys tomorrow morning happy friday um happy tradition traditions day um yeah i'm really excited so yeah it's almost it's about a quarter till 12 um nothing really exciting happened this morning um i just went to walgreens to pick up some mucinex uh for you know my sinus infection that i got going on um and then I'm now heading to Starbucks uh, to get something to drink before I go home. And I'll probably lay around a little bit, to be quite honest. And then I'll get ready for traditions. Um, I'm actually really excited. Like, we get our name tags and everything today. And I got lucky because my traditions is only four hours long. And, like, they broke it up, so I have another class tomorrow. Um, whereas, like, in the past, like, it just used to be, like, an eight-hour day in general. Um, so, yeah, we get our, um, uh, name tags today, which I'm really excited about. And then we also get our blue IDs. Meaning, as soon as I get my blue ID, I get my 40% discount off of merch that's until like February something or other um and I also can get into cast connections uh that's like where there's merchandise that is that can't be sold to like actual guests so they discount it and cast members are allowed to buy it and a lot of the time like they're perfectly fine just it's minuscule things but like it still makes the product imperfect so they can't sell it to guests um However, since all of the Disney hundredth um, stuff just came out, you have to have a you have to have a reservation for like the next. I think it's like three ish days now, because uh, I think it already started. You have to have a reservation to get into Cast Connections, and I don't think I can make that until I get into the hub, which I can't do until I start training. So, <coughs> um. That might just have to wait. But after traditions, we're gonna go up to Disney University and casting and like take some pictures. Um, but yeah, so I will be back with y'all whenever I'm getting ready to go to traditions. All right, so I just wanted to show you my outfit real quick. This shirt is from Shein. These pants are from Calvin Klein. And then these shoes are from Francesca's. Um, I just straightened my hair, did my makeup how I normally do. I did put eyelashes on though, just because I didn't want to rub my eyes. We did it! Forget! Alrighty, so we just got back from traditions. Got my little name tag. Got my Mickey ears. Um, we went to Disney University and took some pictures. And now I'm gonna go get changed and we're coming over to Port Orleans Riverside to get some well-deserved beignets. Hey y'all, so it's Saturday, uh, day after traditions. Uh, so we had traditions yesterday. I don't think I talked too much about it. Um, basically, it was only a four hour class yesterday and we just, um, I don't wanna give too much away, but um, we just learned about the company more. Um, and then we got our name tags and we also got um, our Mickey ears. So after traditions, um, we went to Disney University, literally racing against time uh, because the sun was going down and we got some pictures there and then we came back and then um, we went to Port Orleans French Quarter and we got beignets. Lovely. Oh, we also got our uh, blue IDs yesterday, so I now have access to all the discounts, which is um, scary. Um, and then... So it's today, Saturday. So we kind of have, it's the second part of traditions, but it's called Bring Magic to Life. Um, it should, I have it at 1.30 and it says that it goes until six. So four and a half hours, we'll see. Um, it didn't take a full four hours yesterday for traditions. 
but I kind of liked how they broke it up. So there's some traditions going on today, but there's also like these classes going on today. So I have that in a little while. Um, I'm like already ready for it. I just gotta put on my clothes. But yeah, um, that's pretty much all that I got going on today. I just woke up this morning and had breakfast and then got ready. Um, I kind of wanted to go to the cheer and dance competitions tonight over at ESPN, um, ESPN Complex. However, I do have training in the morning at 7.15 at Magic Kingdom. So that means I gotta leave here around 6.40. So, I'll probably get up at like 5.30. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Um, but yeah, I probably won't go over to the competition tonight. Maybe tomorrow after I get off. Because I get off at like 4 tomorrow. We'll see. But yeah. Um, but I'll show you what I'm wearing to my second class. Alrighty, so this is what I'm wearing to the second day of traditions class. Um, this top's from Shein. This skirt is also from Shein. These boots, little boobies, I think they're from like Kohl's. But yeah. Um, and then I got my little bean pack here. Um, did pretty much like the same makeup like I did yesterday, and I just straightened my hair again. And then I also had a blazer. I'm gonna bring just in case it's cold in the room but yeah so we're gonna walk over now and I think we're gonna be there for about like four and a half hours so I'll check in with you later hey y'all so it's um a little while later um we had that second class today and basically that was just going over like all of our like quote-unquote trainings that we had um just like as a company in general um yeah, that was, that was a good four hours. Um, nothing too exciting. And then me and my one with me went and got Chipotle. Because so I was craving it and I had a gift card. And now I'm just, um, I'm going to get a package. Um, I start on the job training tomorrow. But tomorrow's more so, um, we get a tour of the Magic Kingdom since that's where I'm working. Get to go to costuming, get my costumes, and all that stuff. Um, but I will check in with y'all tomorrow morning on my way to work. Good morning! So it is Sunday. Um, first day of training. Um, so I'm on my way to Magic Kingdom. I'm just now in like the Flamingo parking lot. Um, it is a good 6.30 a.m. Got up at 5.30. Um, yeah, so that's kind of just going to be the reality of the next six months. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be all morning, all night. I got a mixture of both um, this week for training. So it should be fun. Um, I'm honestly, I can be a morning person. Um, I used to work at Duncan and I always worked morning shifts. Um, it's just, uh, for me, I gotta get back into the habit of, like, waking up that early. Or more so the habit of going to bed early. Because I would go to bed at, like, eh, like 11 o'clock. Turn right? Or so. But yeah, so I'm on my way to work and I will check in with y'all when I'm done. All right, everyone, I just got back from my first shift. I'm not gonna lie, I love it. Um, oh, I don't even think I said where I like officially am. So I will be working in Under the Sea, The Journey of the Little Mermaid, or we just like to call it Mermaid. Um, so yeah, basically today, once again, I'm not giving a lot away, but um, I got there at 7.15 this morning. We did an entire walking tour of all of the Magic Kingdom. Um, and then we got together with our trainer, like, for our specific role and, like, attraction. And then we just did a bunch of, like, 
like busy stuff well not necessarily busy stuff but like like some online training we got our costumes and then um kind of just showed us like where we would be going where we meet our trainers for our next shift but yeah that was pretty much it um but for the rest of the night i'm kind of i'm just gonna do some uh work for my internship and then yeah i'll just kind of hang out but other than that, I think that in concludes my uh, first week here in Florida because tomorrow I'm off and I'm quite literally not doing anything because I don't have my self-admission pass yet. Uh, but that's fine. It's fine. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to leave you guys here with that. Uh, if you have any questions um, about anything that happened this week, um, feel free to leave them down below or you can comment them on my Instagram. Um, but yeah, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be on the lookout for our next one. Bye guys!